Hello everyone, let's study today about the heritage entrusted to only one person. Nichiren Daishonin, the true Buddha who appeared in the world in the defiled and evil age of Mapo, established the Dai Gohonzun of the High Sanctuary of the Essential Teaching, Hormon, as the source for all people to attain Buddhahood. Prior to passing away, the Daishonin transferred the entirety of his Buddhism to Nikko Shonin with two transmission documents. At the time, the Daishonin wrote, the entrustment of the law that Nichiren propagated throughout his life. I, Nichiren, transfer the entirety of the law that I have propagated throughout my life to Byakuren Ajari Nikko and designate him the great master of the propagation of the essential teaching. When the servant accepts this law, erect the high sanctuary of the temple of the essential teaching, Hon Monji at the foot of Mount Fuji, not Shinanomachi SGI headquarters. You must simply wait for the time. This is the true law of percepts. Above all else, my disciples should obey these documents. The ninth month of the fifth year of Kuan, 1282, Nichiren the order of the heritage from Nichiren to Nikko. And in the Minobu entrustment document, he wrote, I transfer Shakyamuni Buddha's 50 years of teachings to Byakuren Ajari Nikko. He is to be the head priest of Minobu Sankwanchi. Any lady or priest who defy this have gone against the law. The thirteenth day of the tenth month of the fifth year of Koan, 1282, Ikegami, Musashi Province, Nichiren. This act by the Daishonin thus accomplished the extremely important transfer of his teachings, and furthermore, regarding this transfer, the Daishonin purposely wrote the order of the heritage from Nichiren to Nikko. Herein lays the crucial point regarding the transmission and transfer of true Buddhism. Among the Daishonin's many disciples, only Nikko Shonin was entrusted with the heritage of all true Buddhism. The ultimate principles of Buddhism and the heritage of the entity of the law are of truly immense importance. For this reason, the greatest, most fundamental governing truth of Buddhism is this transmission shared between Buddhas that is entrusted to only one person, based on the relationship between master and disciple. This is explained in the transmission concerning the first path, Ubuyu Sojoji, as follows. This transmission is all transmission from Nichiren to one resume-made disciple, the sacred transmission interested to only one person. Also, the 106th article reads, the entrustment of the direct bestowal of the coherence of essentials is to only one person. Furthermore, on the true cause reads, this is only between me, Nichiren, and you, Nikko. Twenty-six high priest Nichikan Shonin explains the phrase, the law that Nichiren propagated throughout his life in this way. The law that Nichiren propagated throughout his life means 
the object of worship of the essential teachings. Nichiren Nich Daishonin transferred to Nikko Shonin, the Daigo Honzon of the essential teaching, Honmon, thus including, including both the entity of the law and the doctrine. Thank you very much for listening. Now oh, let's study the heritage of the entity of the law for the next time if you have a chance. Please listen again. We'll see you again. Thank you very much.